Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Alyssa, but I go by Liz. I hope you consider sticking around and subscribing because we have a blast here. We talk Disney, Loungefly, Funko Pops, so we do some unboxings and some hauls. And if you are a returning subscriber, hi, welcome back. I am so happy you are here. Guys, I have such an exciting video today because I am doing my top 10 favorite Loungefly bags. It was very hard, I'm not gonna lie guys, it was so hard to pick out what bags I like. I think I have like 180 bags in my collection, so narrowing it, like narrowing it down to 10 bags was the hardest thing in the world it took me an hour maybe a couple hours to figure out what bags are my favorite or which ones i consider like i wear all the time that i like to style more or just i wear often but i pick the ones and it's painful but i did it <laughs> but if you guys want to see what are my top 10 favorite lounge fly bags then keep on watching all right guys so to start off this video i'm just gonna grab whatever bag is near me i'm not gonna go in any particular order so the first bag is gonna be one of my favorites of course it is the shrek and donkey bag i love this bag so much guys it's so funny it's hilarious but it's adorable i love the movie shrek i grew up with it i go to whenever i go to universal i think that one area is just like it's like a must you gotta see and I think this is just so, so, so cute. I love how they look. I love how it's like a cosplay bag. I love how Shrek is up here and then Donkey's right here and Donkey's ears do move. And I love the details on this bag, especially the zipper pull with the um, stack of waffles. And the colors are just so cool. And on the back, you said it says, that'll do Donkey, that'll do which is one of my like like it's an iconic quote from shipwreck you got the lounge fly plaque and the hardware is like a rust rustic color and on the inside you just got a bunch of the shrek s's and this one does have a pocket on the inside of the bag but this bag is so funny guys i can't tell you how many compliments i've got on this bag because it's just hilarious the next bag is going to be something that really holds a um, meaning to, special meaning to me it is the bell like the pink bell bag Josh got this for me for it was in the beginning of COVID it was our um, anniversary and we unfortunately weren't able to see each other for a few months and he got me a bag which this just holds a lot of meaning to me I love this bag so much because I love Beauty and the Beast I love books and color pink is just of course like one of my favorites so I am just so happy and so lucky that he got me this beautiful bag it is truly so stunning I love it because it's a very neutral bag even though it has the pink but the pink is very neutral and it's a very light pink which I love so you have a front pocket with all these amazing characters you have chip mrs. Potts you got Belle, and you have all these amazing details on the bag you got the gold hardware and then you do have side pockets on this one with the pink straps and I love this color pink guys I think it's just so pretty and on the inside it's just gray and it has B all over it and this one does not have an inside pocket but I don't mind because this bag is so beautiful holds a special place in my heart and I'm just I love this one so so much so following that pink aesthetic we are going to dive into this one this is probably my favorite sequence bag guys it's my absolute favorite it is the cotton candy pink sequence bag bag by um, awesome collectibles so this was another bag that I sadly missed out on but Josh being the amazing boyfriend he is he went and drove to awesome collectibles when it restocked in store and got me one this bag is so beautiful guys it's even more beautiful in person so you got this beautiful beautiful pink sequence you got rolls gold um, hardware which I so so love for this bag and you got the beautiful bow you got the awesome pink lounge fly plaque so this bag is just full-on like decked out in pink which I love it has side pockets you have that beautiful baby pink for the straps and as for the inside 
course, you're gonna have pink as the inside and it has white polka dots. And this one does have a zipper on the back. So here is this one, definitely probably top, probably my top, one of my top favorites because this bag is just so beautiful. So the next one is gonna be a, a when I saw that Loungefly posted this. I knew I had to have it and if I didn't, I didn't even think it wasn't an option of me not having this bag because I love turtles. Turtles, I just, they're my favorite animal in the entire world. So I got the squirt bag that was released. I don't think this was a part of the, like the Comic Con release. I think it was just a, like a bag release that was on Loungefly, but I was able to get this amazing bag. It is squirt. He looks just so, so cute. I love it. This bag, it's definitely bigger in person, but I don't mind it. I think it's such a beautiful and amazing bag. He just looks so adorable. I love the details and the color of this bag. And on the back, you just have um, this gorgeous blue with bubbles and it is silver hardware. And then you got the plain blue on the back and it says rip it, roll it, and punch it. And for the inside, you just have that same print of like on his shell. And this one do, does not have a pocket on the inside. But again, with these amazing bags, I really don't mind if they have a pocket on the inside. I really like them to have like side pockets, but with this bag, I don't care. I just love the details and the color in this bag in general. Alrighty guys, so a next bag or the next bag I'm going to show you is one that I, when I first started collecting, I really wanted it and I found it for such a great price and I'm so happy I was able to. It is the Teacup Park bag. This bag is so amazing and I've worn it so many times. So it's this beautiful off-white and it has teacups all around it. You have the purple detail to the bag, the purple lounge fly plaque. These straps are purple and these ones do have side pockets. And the bag is silver wear, um, silver hardware, and then it's kind of faded, but there's some really cute like prints um, in the inside with purple. And this one does not have a inside pocket, but this bag is so beautiful. I think it makes up for the inside not having a pocket. So the next one is, uh, guys, I have the entire, entire collection of like, or series of this bag, and it was so hard to pick which one, but I fun, I, I did it. It is the, um, I think it's the DEC series, um, with the Snow White, the uh, Sleeping Beauty, and then the Little Mermaid. I picked the Little Mermaid because it's one of my favorite movies right next to Beauty and the Beast, so I had to get this one in the favorites video because this is such a beautiful bag. You have Ariel looking so amazing. You have, oh my, it's just, this bag just has so many details, guys. You got Atlantica right there. You got Ursula looking down on her. But this bag is truly just like it's beauty like it's so amazing you got a pocket right here but i try not to use it i did buy this from a reseller so i believe they must have used this because it kind of is like popping up which it's fine but i just don't use it and then um this one does have side pockets and this is the back and as for the inside it just has all these amazing creatures under the sea with flounder and this one does not have a pocket on the inside but this bag is literally an art piece it's a art piece it's beautiful it's everything i want in a little mermaid bag the next bag is going to be again one of my favorites it was gifted to me by josh and i just love this one because it's probably one of my favorite attractions at disneyland i think the skippers just it's they're like my favorite part of the ride because the skippers are just so funny they have awesome jokes so it is the mini main attraction jungle cruise this bag is so beautiful i love this so you got the striped pattern same as the ears um this the ears are sequenced as well as the front pocket you got this amazing detail the leopard print is fuzzy 
and I don't, I can't tell you what material this is, but it's just so cool. Um, it does have side pockets as well as the front pocket. It is a gold hardware, and the inside is this leopard print as well, but it's green on the inside. And this one does not have a pocket, but this one, I think the details just really like gravitate me to this bag because it's just so fun and super cute and one of my favorite mini main attraction bags for sure. So the next one is going to be, I love this bag because of many different reasons. It is the Neon Parks bag. So I got my friend her first lounge fly bag. This was her, I got her one and I gave it to her for her first lounge fly and she loves it. And I just, I really regretted not getting myself one, but I did restock like a while back. And it just, I love being able to like have matching bags with her. And I just, I just love it. I just, I love it. It's just so beautiful. You got all these amazing icons. You got the TK Room Bird. You got Dole Whip, the Small World um, a Clock. You have Mickey Balloons. You have like the Carousel. Ah, you got like a little um, skull for pirates. You got a lot of amazing icons on this bag. Super, super beautiful. I definitely love this bag because it's just, oh my gosh, it's just so amazing. There you guys go. And I love the bright neon green plaque. I think it's super, super cool. And they do have striped um, black straps, but it's awesome because you can see everything on the back. This one, it does have side pockets and it's silver hardware. For the inside, you've got a bunch of like stars and Mickey heads and they are neon. And for this, it does not have a uh, inside pocket. But again, with these bags, I don't care if they have an inside pocket because they, they de the details in the bags themselves are just so incredible. That just kind of makes up for it, you know? But definitely one of my favorites. I wear this often because it's just a black bag but has all these like pops of colors. So I think we have two left and I'm going to end this video with my two favorite bags that are on my shirt. The um, second to last one is the Grumpy bag. I love this bag so much. It's so Funny. I think it's really hilarious. I love how grumpy looks. It is a rather large bag um, Just with appliques and just how grumpy looks. It's definitely a large bag But I think he just looks so sick and cute. I love how he looks and then you got his like little beard on the bottom you got the red bag and you have this super cute photo of grumpy and snow white you got this beautiful brown strap, gold hardware, and this does have side pockets. And for the inside, you just have a bunch of grumpies and jewels. Super, super cute. This one does have an inside pocket, which is awesome, but I just think this bag is just so, so cute and adorable. So last but not least is going to be Dopey. Dopey is one of my favorite characters ever. I think he's just so funny and just like, oh, I just think he's adorable. I love him so much. So this is the Dopey bag. I did get this one at Cir uh, Circle of Hope. I think it's sold out, but you can sign up on the wait list. But this is from Circle of Hope. This bag is so cute. I love how it looks. I love so this is a front pocket, but again, I don't really use the pockets like these because I don't want it to ruin the bag. And the key charm is a little diamond. You got the purple lounge light black. You got Dopey looking super super cute with his purple hat. These do have uh, side pockets. The bag is green. You got something very similar to the grumpy bag, but it is snow white and dopey. You got purple straps gold hardware and this one actually has just all the dwarfs on the inside and this one does have a zipper pocket in the bag but this is the dopey bag and I think 
that actually wraps up my 10 favorite lounge fly bags. Alrighty guys, so that does conclude my top 10 favorite lounge fly bags. It was definitely hard to pick up the bags, but I think I had I picked out some really good ones, but if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. What are your top 10 favorite bags that you guys have? Definitely let me know because I would love to know. But again, um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm really trying to come up with more ideas and come out with more and fun content and news. I am going to be changing my schedule around. So from here on out, I am uploading every Wednesdays, 8 a.m. Disneyland time and 11 a.m. Disney World time. I think it's just gonna work better for me and I think weekdays would just be a great idea. But again, if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys all have a magical day and I will see you guys next time. Bye!